So guys, we have the Blu-ray sales for this week. No, not this week. We this week finally. We have sales for Godzilla. And my predictions were around three hundred thousand to four hundred thousand for the Blu-rays. But Godzilla might be doing way better than I expected it to do. Um it was behind Endgame on Amazon for a little bit. Um but a lot of people did pre order the movie. Um and number one is Godzilla, King of the Bosses. They haven't really updated the best selling Blu rays of twenty nineteen as well. They have not updated um yet. So we're over the important movies. Um Godzilla, um, but we will not be covering every movie's gross until the DVD comes out. We won't be covering three movies this week, Godzilla, Avengers, and Alita, which will all be in separate videos, and separate three to four minute videos. So Godzilla Kingdom of Monsters is, and we'll be, we can also go over the types of Pikachu as well in this video, because they're both made by the same company. Godzilla is doing pretty well for a movie that only made, that kind of underperformed greatly at the box office. God, it seems that the audiences, people who love Godzilla, um, fans of Godzilla, decided to get this on Blu-ray. So it's gonna make a million copies on Blu-ray, okay, by the end of the year. Because Black Friday is gonna happen, and it's gonna sell at least 200,000 copies, 100 to 200,000 on Black Friday. <clears throat> and Godzilla is just destroying Secret Life of Pets 2 that's made way more money than Godzilla. There's another, Godzilla is another example of movies, of movies completely <laughs> dominating movies that made way more money than, um, you go up Blu-ray to 2019, Godzilla is only at 400,000, um, you know, it is ahead of, um, Hellboy, Creed 2, The Buell, Grass, and it's also beating Us as well, which Us made $171 million, the growth does not really translate to success. At the Blu-ray market, and then we have, but this is only one week of Godzilla. This is not, so we look to go over movies that made more money than Godzilla. For example, Mary Poppins Returns made more money than Godzilla, yet it has a worse first week than Godzilla: King of the Monsters, and it'll probably drop 78% like a typical blockbuster does, which means it'll be around 116 to 125 copies, which means Brand Black and Nastro is gonna flop. On Blu-ray, that's an also another thing. Well, let's go over um various other various movies that does did does as well. And then we have the Grinch. Despite the Grinch selling two hundred six seventy million dollars domestically, the Grinch is way behind Godzilla, which made one point six way less money than um Godzilla. Godzilla is beating the Grinch as well. It is ninety. It's already a hundred thousand ahead of the Grinch, and Godzilla will likely do pretty well on DVD on one hundred fifty thousand. So it means around four hundred fifty thousand copies its first week. So Godzilla um is also ahead of. I think it's ahead of a reader as well. A reader Battle Angel. So three hundred fifty-seven thousand, which it beat the Grinch as well, and it's still gonna beat the Grinch probably by the end of the year. On Blu-ray alone, not DVD, because the Grinch sold well on DVD, um, Pikachu. And then let's compare the D Pikachu, another movie, um, here of the Pikachu, 376 billion. Pikachu is actually at the same numbers as Godzilla, so Godzilla could be put down, but if we don't have a good comparison, Detective Pikachu and Godzilla came out at the same time, and Detective, if it drops similar to Detective Pikachu, but there's no real competition next week other than Man Black to National what's and Books Bot which Books Bot's gonna flop on Blu ray. Um no one's gonna buy it. You know, at the store they have you you can see Man Black to National, they have copies saying on sales that no one is buying. Okay. I think Doc Phoenix is gonna do similar to Hellboy. It's gonna do better than they expected because Disney threw the movie out and it got bad reviews, but Hellboy got bad reviews as well and it sold three hundred thousand copies, eighty thousand Copy. So then we have to go bigger titles. Wealth Breaks the Internet. Okay, Wealth Breaks the Internet sold. Four actually that's way more than Godzilla. Um And we're not compared to these movies up here because these movies made like five hundred thousand copies first week. Um A Star Wars Born, let's see how Star Wars Born opened opened um here. You know, three hundred seventy thousand. So this so Godzilla is comparable to Star Wars Born and um and uh, Pikachu and 
other movies that opened t at similar time around this time. So that means Godzilla could do as well as A Star Is Born. And so this was copied, so Godzilla will read a million copies by the end of the year. Because all these movies, um, have sold a million copies. That open here, Pikachu is going to read it, and Alita is going to read it as well. Um, the Grinch has reached a million copies. Um, here. And Godzilla it will be, will probably, actually it's weird. So, 550 million, I, I, my man, my man, my man, so. Godzilla will be between, um, the Lion King and the Greatest Showman. Um, here, you can see here, a read about Angel will probably reach a million, um, by the end of the year. Pokemon Detective Pikachu is very close to a million as well. Um, it will be the 15th and 16th movies respectively. Um, Godzilla will likely reach that amount. So, that's basically it. Goodbye.